Um, being that you run your own marketing company, um, is offline marketing still as effective as it was, say, 20 years ago? Or has the world sort of shifted towards more social, you know, social media type of marketing? That's a really good question. Um, I think I think the answer to that question is not as relevant as it depends on what type of business it is. Yeah. And it also comes back to marketing is all about attention. So if you talk to me about if I if you were a new client, I'd ask you a lot of questions about who you were targeting and why you were targeting that group and, and what your typical customer looks like. And then we work out whether that type of person, you'd have to draw some generalizations, but would that type of person be on, more likely to engage with someone on social media or would they be more likely to read the newspaper or would they be more likely to be listening to talkback radio or would they be influenced by their children on social media and on their platforms or grandchildren? So a lot of people will, will jump to the conclusion that social media has killed off every other um, platform and that, that's a common sort of assumption that people make but it doesn't always necessarily reign true. Your bang for buck would always be determined by um, the reach that you can get to your market. So I'll give you an example. Pick a, top, pick, pick a business for me and I'll give you an example. Okay, so um, cleaning service. Cleaning service, okay. So I would argue, without, without doing any research, I would argue that if you were able to do an effective mail drop to businesses in um, high-density business areas and industrial parks, and when I say an effective mail drop, you don't want to end up rolled up with your Coles and Woolies catalogs. Because yeah. what people do is they take the whole lot and they put it on the bin. So if you were able to structure something in such a way or include a gift or something that bulks it up and makes the person take note of that mail drop, and you did that into a specific area of, um, like I said, businesses or industrial parks or whatever it might be, I would argue that you would get a higher ROI on that than you would spending your money on Facebook. Okay. Because it's harder to target business owners and, and facilities managers and things like that on um, Facebook. You might have a, you might have a decent um, return on LinkedIn, but again, LinkedIn can be, can be very expensive to advertise on. So. Okay, so print media still does work, but it really just depends on the industry that you're targeting, whether it will work for it or not. It depend, I think it depends on who you're targeting and also the execution is very important of how you go about it. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night, I raise my hand.